This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. There you go. Well, I <clears throat> shouldn't have interrupted him, but here's the Rock and Roll Express, man. Check me up about uh, Arn Anderson. You were going to say something before uh, JC came in. I, I just, when, when Arn came out and, and the guys that are like that, you know, I just, my, my, my focus now wasn't back then. My focus now is watching, looking at the marks on their forehead. My oh, God. Yeah. I mean, the, 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 him, Magnum, Tully, Dusty, Flair. Can you imagine, like, let's, <clears throat> let's pretend you're, uh, you have no concept of professional wrestling, mm -hmm. but you're like athletic and you want to learn. Maybe you're like a Lex Luger, right? Okay. So you've had a, a, a pro and semi-pro football career and you're bodybuilding now and you look great and you get recruited and they say, okay, here's the deal. If you'll buy your own gear and pay for your own training mm -hmm. and learn to, uh, have incredible wind. Mm -hmm. like we're going to have you do, oh, I don't know, 2000 Hindu squats. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we're going to show you how to throw yourself on the ground mm -hmm. and it not hurt. Now it's going to hurt, but you'll get used to the hurt. You'll get callous to the hurt. Yeah. But if you can just learn how to throw yourself on the ground and, and we'll make sure that after you get your first or second concussion, you figure it out. Uh, then we want you to shave your whole body and, <laughs> and grease yourself up grease yourself up <laughs> what well that's what, that's just, what that's i'm what glad I'm you threw that line in just grease yourself up go ahead grease yourself up because somebody's coming from behind go ahead and then you're going to go out here and there's going to be a guy who is going to also pretend to fight you now occasionally mm -hmm. he's going to punch you real hard in the face and you're just going to have to get used to that right uh and then when it's all done we're going to pay you in cash not very much mm -hmm. but if you'll get in your car mm -hmm. and you'll drive 600 miles tonight We'll let you do it again tomorrow. Right now, next week, uh, we're going to plan on moving you up the card, which means that whatever pay you've been getting, we're going to pay you a little more, but we're going to need you to go to the, the Walgreens and get a razor and then learn mm -hmm. how to break it in half. And we're going to teach you to carry it in your lip. And then when nobody's looking, we want you to take that razor out of your lip, drag it across your forehead and, and spill your own blood. And then when you're done, just go in the back, hose off, jump back in the car, 600 miles to the next town, and we'll do it all over again. Mm. And we love it, Tony. <laughs> I'm not disparaging it. We fucking love it. Right. When we think about what these guys did on a day-to-day -day basis, my God. Oh, I yeah. I have respect for that. Like, yeah. nothing about that seems appealing to me. No, 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 no. You would think, uh, okay, I'll do something else. I'll, I'll just be mortgages. I'm just going to do this. Right. But then you, you, you recognize that that's what these guys did day in and day out. And it's because they loved it. And what do they love to do? They love to entertain us. Sure. Like I just have, I, I hold this profession in such high regard because man, it's really hard to sell it. You know what I mean? When you just yeah. break that down to a layman and you're like, so wait a minute, I'm doing what now? Yeah. I don't know that I want to do that. Right. Well, and then you look at the guys who are on here. It's not to just not to say any disparaging words about the guys who don't have blade marks right. on their head because these guys worked hard too. And I get that, but the guys who had blade marks on their head were the top tier. Yes. And not only that, they wanted to make it so believable that they would go to the extent of cutting themselves that much. That's unbelievable. When you I think. mean, it, it's very apparent now you can just, you know, kind of gig yourself above the hairline and it, it can bleed and it can bleed enough. But back then that wasn't good enough, man. I'm going to cut my fucking self open. We're going to make sure these people are entertained. We're going to make sure this looks good. And that was Arn Anderson, Magnum TA, yeah. obviously dusty through the years, flair, Tully top tier, man. Yeah. Top tier. So, um, so there you go. Yeah. It's, uh, it's in many ways, it's, it's, I know one of the reasons you love it and, uh, everybody who joins us on ad free shows and, and Patreon and listens to us on Westwood one, that's why they love it. That's why I love it. It's, uh, I've often said, and, uh, back then it was even more so because of cafe back then it is, it's more, it's, it's more than athletics. It's an art form, right? It really is.
And uh, I, I, it, I totally agree that it's an art form, which is why, you know, it's not in the Olympics. You know, it's it's yeah. art. Yeah, well, the, first of all. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.